In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix any stuttering or playback issues you may be having in your Windows 11 computer. So the first thing we need to do is just head over to our start menu and search for settings and then click on the settings window. From the left hand side, select apps, click on video playback. And the first option we have at the top is this save network bandwidth by playing a video at lower resolution. Now, if you currently have this turned off, then I'd recommend trying to enable this and seeing if it makes a difference. If you already have it turned on, then I would do vice versa and I would try turning it off. Now if that doesn't really make much of a difference then what you can do is come down to battery options and we're just going to change the setting here to optimize for video quality and then we're going to scroll down and click on HDR. Now if you scroll down slightly again make sure you have your display monitor selected and then we're going to scroll down and you'll see HDR video streaming. You want to make sure this option is turned on like so and then you can come back out of this window head over to system from the left hand side scroll down and select storage scroll down again until you see storage sense and you want to make sure this option here is turned on like so this is going to clean up your temporary files and just ensure we have adequate storage space on our computer so this is an important feature that you have enabled and once you've done that the last thing we're going to do is head over to our start menu search for adjust the appearance and then click on adjust the appearance and performance of windows now underneath the visual effects tab you want to make sure you have custom selected and then from here we're going to uncheck everything apart from animate controls and elements inside windows, animations in the taskbar, enable peak, show thumbnails instead of icons, and smooth edges of screen fonts. Everything else here, just leave it unchecked and then press apply and OK. And then once you've done that, you can try loading up your video to check if that fixes any playback issues. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next one.